but it's great to, uh, to be here on this uh, really epic day uh, because this is going to mean so much to Greenville. People come from all over the country and even the world to see what we've done in downtown Greenville and the question they often ask is how did you do this? Uh, a couple things that are part of our magic ingredients. Uh, number one is great public spaces. Places where people want to be, want to gather, want to enjoy. The second thing we have, of course, is mixed use. We have that magical use, mix of uses with office development downtown. We have the residential. And of course, what's really launched here, and the thing that makes this particularly exciting and momentous for downtown Greenville's mix of uses, is the retail component. And with this project, with One City Plaza, downtown Greenville really joins the big leagues of retail centers in our region. Well, the other aspect of our success is something we talk about too, and that's more of the process, and that has to do with partnerships. And this too is a wonderful example of partnerships and why they're different and why they're special in downtown Greenville and what makes us so, so successful as a result of that. And it was only 31 short months ago <laughs> that we actually started this uh, project with the, with the series of uh, public meetings in which we, uh, the city, and Civitas, the architect, took input and tried to incorporate that input into what you see here today. And there, there are several pieces that are, that are relevant. We got the, the main piece right here on uh, Main Street, this elliptical with the, the tree. I know the tree is not a large tree, but that is at, at some point in its uh, future is going to be a, a, a very nice specimen tree similar to what you see on Main Street. And then we, we created this sort of a forest environment b behind us with the concrete sofa and with a semi-static fountain that is not overwhelming, but it was intensely uh, designed to be a very calm, soothing atmosphere when you when you came to this uh, this plaza, and so there's many features around here, and we we definitely invite you to go around and, and sort of get a feel for them. This is a shade structure, and you've got the the seating underneath it, and we hope that um, that this this acts as a as a gathering place where you can come and you can enjoy. Uh, maybe a cool drink on a on a warm afternoon or have one of the restaurants do takeout or whatever set here bring your lunch and then the granite floor was originally designed with a concrete floor and um, we, we just felt that a plaza of this significance needed to be something a little bit better than concrete so again we went back to the city council and said let's let's look at granite and so we've got over 30,000 square feet of granite pavers in this plaza and it's going it goes all the way to the back to the Bank of America building and then to both ends on Lawrence Island. The folks in one are the people who have made this happen. I mean, I was able, I was lucky enough to be able to be in a place to assemble them together to make this happen, but I'm just sort of the middleman. Everybody is going to benefit from this, not just the folks of Greenville who I hope will come here, but everybody in the building. So on behalf of everybody, I'd like to thank you and then I would again like to thank everybody who's in that building who came together and let us do this project. So thank you very much. But today, One City Plaza is an active destination. We want you to come eat your lunch here, bring your families here. We want you to spend time here, and we hope you will enjoy it. So thank you again for being here. And this will officially open and dedicate the, the new great public space in downtown, which by the way is now One City Plaza. <laughs>